What we got? Go first, dude. That might be what I have, man. Yeah, you got the same thing. Oh, it's a snowy. Dude, I got a giant then. Snowy. What is going on, y'all? Captain Collier here. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Brandon, and I fish all along the Alabama Gulf Coast for anything and everything that can bend a rod. Uh, this is the day before a fishing trip. Tomorrow is supposed to be going with Captain Bo. Slow pitch jigging offshore. If y'all watch the channel, y'all know I have a couple videos doing that before. But before we get into that, I do want to announce that Goofish Rods is now a sponsor of the channel. I want to show y'all a couple of my setups here. Y'all know I use my blue Goofish Rod here, paired up with an Accurate 300. This is a 6'6 uh, six, six foot rod. This rod is good for up to 500 gram weight jigs, and uh, it's a good little rod, very strong. It's very tough. Uh, I've used it a a couple times, Captain Bo has a couple of them and hasn't broke one yet. They're really strong and actually pretty affordable if you're trying to get into slow pits jigging. I also purchased this matte black goofish 6.6 rod. This is basically the same thing as the blue one. It's just uh, rated for lighter jigs. So this one is rated for 120 to 250 gram jigs. The main point of me showing you all this is to show you what you'll get if you do order one of these rods. So it comes in one of these tube-like containers here if you order online. And uh, it has like a little bamboo stick to uh, brace it up if it, so it won't get damaged in shipping. All right, so here we go. Uh, Goofish was nice enough to send me a free rod. Uh, it's actually the same as this one right here. And uh, it comes in a little carrying case here. If you like that kind of stuff, I probably won't ever use this just because I always have a reel on my rods ready to go. But a very nice carrying case, to say the least. And uh, we're just gonna pull it out here, show you what it looks like. And there we go. That's the rod that uh, came in the package. Like I said, it's the same as this rod right here. This particular rod has spiral wrap guides twisting to the left. Hopefully y'all can see that. They have options for spiral wrap to the left or the right, and they also have two-piece rods. I'm gonna pair this rod up with the Sigler SGN reel. This is a very great reel, uh, very light, strong. I think it has like 28 pounds of drag, and uh, that's what you want with these rods, because this, I mean, this is a very light rod, and you know, if you go slow pitch jigging, you're typically gonna be doing it for a while. And if you have just a big, bulky, heavy reel on here, it's just really gonna do a toll on your shoulders. So that's why I got this reel. If y'all are interested in buying one of these rods, you are able to get a 10% discount uh, if you use code CAP Collier. I'll put a little text right here. That way, whenever you go to buy it, you can get these off Amazon or off their site. Type in that code, it'll give you 10% off, cover the tax, shipping, whatever it may be. But that's the deal, y'all. I know we're gonna tear some fish up tomorrow. We're gonna have a great time, so y'all be sure to stay tuned. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. It's completely free. Helps me out a lot, and uh, hopefully we'll get on some fish tomorrow. So with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and rig some of this stuff up, and we'll see you out on the water. I'm seeing line I've never seen before on this reel. <laughs> 500 foot of water here, y'all. First drop. Man, I already hit bottom. We just sit still drifting. Slow drift. I'm on, I'm on. He ain't very big. It's a fish though. Now I just got a 500 feet. <laughs> we'll talk to you in a couple minutes. Yeah. Turn the camera on in about three minutes. <laughs> you gonna make me put clown on it. Oh. Got it Done pulled it. I got four hooks on there and pulled the hook. Look at that. No, that ain't right. <laughs> That don't sound good. Oh, that's a good fish. That's a good fish. That's a dang hoss. Oh. <laughs> 
Mine ain't. I ain't feeling like much of nothing. Hmm. 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 Get him. Mine's just dead weight coming up. Great. Come on. What we got? What we got? Sea bass. Oh, yeah, long tail sea bass. Nice fish. Sea bass. Woo wee. That's a good one there, ain't it? It is, man. Pretty. On it. That is pretty. Beautiful. That's on that 300 gram Johnny Jig torpedo slow pitch jig. Hit and reverse one more time. One Both. Side, Tell me when. Yeah, that's all Jack got me. We want to get the gaff, get it up on the boat. That's a big Almaco. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we get the gaff. Get the gaff. Right above your head. Get the gaff. Big Almaco right there. Yeah. I've never seen it. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Yeah, it is. That's about the size of that one we caught on my trip, Cody, a couple months ago. Get some knuckles on that. Yeah, man. Got a couple fish up. Look at that horse there. That's a big old Almaco Jack. Throw him in the box as well. Let him down slow. Let him down slow. <laughs> I'm over here waiting on the queue and you're already hit bottom. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, can't no. You got too. No. Man, I just don't get how they miss four hooks. <laughs> oh, he's on there. <laughs> he was on there. You got a rock. I think I got a poor you or a bee liner. Are you on there? Yeah, he's on there. Very small. Might be another sea bass. Sea bass. Yeet. Sea bass killer. Cody, this is what we're after. Yeah. This is what we're after. Yeah. You know, Simple, man. They like that. They like that jig right that's there. That's a good one there. Yep. So we are 790 feet now. Manual reels. Everybody else is using electric reels. We're the only men on the boat here. <laughs> or we're just stupid. <laughs> there we go. We got 300 yards of 20 pound braid. Hopefully, we can make it to the bottom. Been running from storms all morning. Potato Head's talking all this crap up here, but he's only got one baby's camp in the box. Hey, I got two big old beeliners though. Ooh. What kind of setup you're using there? Uh, That's the black goofish rod and a. SGN. Yep, that's the one I was showing y'all earlier on in this video. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna take my horse to the old town road. <laughs> and making fun of my ponytail. Well, do that, and then, then the song Pony, too. Yeah, right. yeah, that'd be perfect. You yeah. lead into Pony, and then finish with the old town road. I'm gonna have you a playlist just for you, call your next song. All right, we'll do that on the trip out to the fast. That's the only two songs we got. All right, <laughs> I'm about halfway down. There's the spool. We're getting getting pretty uh, narrow here. <laughs> I, I think I put 300 yards on that. There's the spool. We're getting on down there. I've never seen this line before. Oh, no, I see the spool. Uh-oh. <laughs> My spool looks embarrassing. <laughs> Title of this video: Fish, ooh, fishing with a bass rod in 800 feet of water. <laughs> that's a. I don't think that's a, a minnow. Oh, I think it's a smallmouth bass. And we'll get back to y'all right after this ad break. <laughs> 
All right, I'm ought to be about three quarters of the way. Ta sea bass. Nice. Sea bass. Better than pork. It's not a minnow. You got one here? Nope. Oh. There we go. What, what size gram weighs that? 300. 300? Yep. You got 300 just like that one if you want to do they really love this color. Yeah. A little sandwich. Say so when. All right. I'll be there about 10 minutes. Oh, we're getting close to the bottom of the spool. The end of it. It's the second drop here in this 790 feet today. Let's hit bottom. I feel like I'm getting. I feel like I'm getting hits. Oh, I am. There we go. I do. Little? Yeah. Very little. Time to make the reel back up. Yeah, I think it's another sea bass. They love this color jig. Another sea bass. He's a little small. Man, they love this color jig. Y'all can see his eyeballs is poked out there. And that's from coming up from that deep water, obviously. That deep pressure down there. We'll throw him in the box. Got a tile fish. There we go. What is that? What the heck? What is that, he? Bearded A bearded bar. That was caught on that squid there. Nice little blue line tile fish. You got one? Oh yeah. <laughs> I think it's another sea bass. I don't know if I got a messed up jig or a very small fish. I ain't felt them fight one time. You got some kind of fish down there. Do I? He been on there a while. I think it's the jig. No, it is a fish, ain't it? No, it is a fish. What you got, Another sea bass. The sea bass king. Look at that now. He's eating something that much bigger than him. It's the, almost the same size. The sea bass came. Man. Again. I, he wasn't fighting not one bit. <laughs> We're gonna be in 660 foot this time. Shallow. <laughs> Shallowing up. Okay. See him showing up there. Oh yeah. I think that's sea bass. You think so? He'll find it. Yeah, I do. They up that high? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you got it zoomed in. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Oh, I didn't see that. 640, gotcha. 610, so 30 feet up the bottom. Good, good. Maybe I'll catch that, that big one right there. Let's get it. 660 foot on this drop. Turned out to be a beautiful day. Okay, just hit bottom. Okay. Fish on. Uh oh. Yeah. That's a little bit better fish there. We'll talk to you in a couple minutes. <laughs> got you one? That's a little bit better one. Well, I say that, now he just gave up. Well, got that's, that's what you want. I got another sea bass. Pretty sure. 90%. Oh, a sea bass. Yep. That's probably what I got. Sea bass. Yeah, buddy. You see him? Another sea bass? Yep. Nice one, too. Yeah. Man. There you go. What's that? Number five, number six for me? Shit, at least. Golly, them suckers are pretty. They pretty much just die as soon as they come up here. Yeah. He ain't even moving. Here we go, y'all. Same jig I've been using all day. I kind of want to change the jig up, try to get something else. Going down to the depths. 
That's what I'm looking like. <laughs> oh, shit. It makes it. There we go. Just hit bottom. <clears throat> Come on. Give me a grouper. Yep, there he is. Got him. Yeah. Good fish. That's a good one. That might be a grouper. That's a very good fish. <clears throat> Heck yeah. That ain't no sea bass there. That might be a world record sea bass. <laughs> it's feeling grouperish the way he's coming up. I look like a bite, Kyle. Ah. He's on there, but I think it's another small sea bass. Sea bass. Golly. Sea bass murderer. I think he's still on there. Yeah. He did this last time. I think he's still on there. It's another small. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. That ain't good. Dang, gum it. He just got short. And you on the bottom, too? Uh, I guess just my drag. Oh, no. The blue goof is about to go down. Uh, dude, that drag's tight. Come on. Losing my favorite jig so far. Oh, was this a big old grouper decided he wanted it? <laughs> I know I ain't fixing to fight this shark 700 foot. I'll see what I mean when I say that goofy is strong. I don't think this is a shark, dude. He gave up. Look. He gave up. Either that or I got half a fish, but the fish that I had didn't have this much weight on it. Walking up way out there, look out there, guys. What we got? Woo! Grouper, dude, that might be what I have, man. Yeah, you got the same thing. Oh, it's a snowy. Dude, I got a giant then. Snowy. Get him. Dive in for him, baby. Yeah. Boat. Dude, get that gas ready, man. Look at that. Yes, sir. Yeah, I feel a head shake, man. Ain't no way that's a grouper. You getting close? Yeah, yeah, I got about two more colors to go. <laughs> <laughs> what do you, do you think it's a shark? I don't think I mean, so. he's fighting. I would have thought. I thought a grouper would usually give up. It could have been now. a big tile. That tile fought me all the way to the top. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't, like if there's a shark on that rod, I think you'd have lost That's your mind. It's not a shark, man. You got a good fish. Yeah. Well, I'm trying, kind of trying to take it easy with them now. I got them you up. Can't call you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> don't. Catch anything. <laughs> hey, if you go in the water, just hold on to the rod. Absolutely. Snoopy. One of my subscribers calls this a Snoopy pole. I think my daughter is yeah. fishing real for Brimble. There he is. What is it? Dang amberjack, ain't it? Ass. Red snapper. <laughs> Watch it be a white snapper, a tail hook. <laughs> Is that a towel? No, it ain't. It's a dang amberjack. Golly. Amberjack. Seriously? And he ain't even that big. Get that, Joker. Ah. Oh. Throw him in that. Uh, 30, 40 to the 40. 30, 40 to the 40. Oh, he's yeah. Throw him in that box. Let me get a uh, big mom. Legal, baby. Leave that home over that camera there. Legal AJ on the, Snoop, on the Snoopy ride. Brother Graham. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he ain't a monster, but I'm just happy I got a legal one. Up. Yeah. 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 Hey, on 20 pound braid and 40 pound fluorocarbon too. Ain't that crazy? The rainbow unicorn is killing it. Another sea bass feels like. Really? Golly, eight, 780 feet for that thing. That's barely even a sandwich. 
All right, guys, well, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Y'all be sure to drop a comment below with any questions or just let me know what you thought about the video. And as always, we'll catch you back on the water next time.